Hi everyone, jumping in the middle of Poetry Thursday and here's Dr Jenny uh, jumping or perhaps hopping into view with <laughs> a poem. A poem, hello everybody. So today I'm reading a poem called Toad. Um, it's by Norman McCaig, who is a Scot or was. Don't know anything about Norman McCaig, really. That's terrible, isn't it? Um, but I'm reading his poem anyway. Scottish poet called Toad. Stop looking like a purse. How could a purse squeeze under the rickety door and sit full of satisfaction in a man's house? You clamber towards me on your four corners, right hand, left foot, left hand, right foot. I love you for being a toad for crawling like a Japanese wrestler and for not being frightened. I put you in my purse hand, not shutting it, and set you down outside directly under every star. A jewel in your head. Toad, you've put one in mine, a tiny radiance in a dark place. Oop. Thank you very much. Good that you found that, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yes. He um he is no longer alive, sadly. Okay. Um I know that he lived in Edinburgh, but he also spent a lot of time in Assint, which is an area of Scotland. Mm, that's on the lock the lochy side, the yeah, west yeah, mountainous yeah. sea lock west coast side. So a lot it? of it is sort of yes. So mm. a lot of it is sort of nature poems. Yeah. yeah. But I, I don't know. He always seems to put this turn in, so you think, oh, he's just talking about some nature, that's nice. And then you suddenly get this devastating line. Mm. Like for me, this one where he's put the put the toad down outside directly under every, every star. star. Oh, no, it's beautiful, um, that. And then it switches up to this more sort of mythical thing about yeah. the jewel. That's a, that's a sort of a legend, isn't it, that toads have jewels in their heads? Yeah, yeah. Um, so uh yeah norman mccaig norman mccaig said he would write the poems in the time it took to smoke a cigarette <laughs> excellent fellow not recommending cigarettes no. but cigarettes um, bad norman mccaig good yeah yeah i do know we read one of his poems we did it in one of my the poetry courses I went to. Oh, right. One called right. Aunt Julia, which is worth checking out. Oh, yeah, there's one called Summer Farm I really like. Mm. Again, it's got the turn. But the no, turn. no spoilers. Okay. Okay, good. Well, right. let's see if that worked. Thank you very much. Bye. See you soon. Bye.